In this guide, I will talk you through Color Refresh, which is our nourishing pigmented hair masks. You can use Color Refresh in so many ways. And today, I will guide you through how to use it as a pre-pigmentation in the salon. As you know, to reach a vivid and deep result, you sometimes need to boost the hair with pigments beforehand. The most common way to do this is to use oxidation color. But by working with Color Refresh, you will save the quality of the hair and time. Color Refresh contains a lot of great ingredients and has the pH of 5 to 5.5. That is the same as the hair's natural pH. This makes Color Refresh the perfect product to prepare the hair for what's next, both for the pigments and the quality of the hair. Color Refresh contains ingredients like panthenol, that both locks in moisture and boosts the volume. We also have wheat protein that gives a long lasting conditioning effect. And last but not least, argan oil to strengthen and give shine to the hair. My model today is blonde at a lightening level nine to 10. We are gonna turn her into a level four to five, which is a dark brown color. Before putting on the color, we need to boost the hair with a lot of red pigments to prevent the color from turning muddy or green. I'm choosing to work with Color Refresh Bright Red, which is a clear red with high intensity. Bright red is the perfect shade to use for our mission today. But of course, Color Refresh has different shades that you can use if you wanna pre-pigment the hair. Sand, for example, is perfect if you have a level 10 and are going a few steps darker, say a level seven to eight. We are applying sand before our oxidation color to prevent green or violet tones, but also to create an even canvas and make our starting position as good as possible. I'm starting today by washing my model's hair. Since Color Refresh has the pH of 5 to 5.5, it's always gonna be the in-between product between shampoo and conditioner. I'm towel drying afterwards to make sure that there are no excess water in the hair. If the hair has too much water in it, the hair won't be able to absorb the Color Refresh as much as I want it to. I'm applying the Color Refresh in sections for a more controlled application process. I'm using a comb to make sure that I reach every strand of the hair. I'm letting it sit for 10 minutes to achieve the red tone that I want today. But of course, the processing time can always be adjusted regarding to your desired results. I'm rinsing the color refresh, and since I'm putting oxidation color on the hair afterwards, I won't be using conditioner as I normally would have. I am applying the oxidation color with a technique that fits the desired results. Washing out the color with shampoo and adding conditioner. And now I'm ready for styling. Thanks to the pre-pigmentation, we now have an amazing deep brown result on my model today. No brassy tones whatsoever. By using Color Refresh as the pre-pigmentation, I saved a lot of time due to the quick process and also spared the quality of the model's hair.